In today's video, I'm back with another case study to show you what hypocrisy or a hypocrite looks like. Let's talk about it. to the most high Yah Shalom. Thank you for tuning in to another Righteous Spiritful episode. Today I'm back at it in them trenches handling that kingdom business. Man, we see that the Pharisees, you know, was constantly called hypocrites for presenting themselves as something that they were uh, actually found out not to be. You know, they presented themselves as righteous, but they were actually the lawless ones. You know, today's video, man, I'm basically reposting uh, from a episode of Pop the Balloon of Fine Love, where these women who are very vain, who are very worldly, you know, pretty much roast this man for having on a wig. And he comes in the same energy that a lot of women come in, as far as wearing this, these, these weaves, these wigs, these hair pieces and all of them pretty much popped their balloon because they didn't like how fake he was. And you'll see that oftentimes, man, women shame men for having uh, the same standards of wanting a natural woman. And these women said, nah, we just can't take you serious. You know, we, 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 uh, we feel like you're not being real, but a woman you know, due to societal norms and men not speaking up, she'll be fake as can be and want you to compliment her. And I tell you, man, I am, I'm on the other side of that. You know, you, you not getting no compliments. Uh, if I know the most high y'all gave you a head of hair and you want to slap a wig on your head, you can't come back in your eyes in front of me, uh, and thinking I'm about to tell you, you look good or you bad. That just ain't finna happen because you know, as a man, I pride myself on being real, you know, not wearing no, 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 no hair pieces and man weaves and all of that stuff. But these women, they love this stuff, man. And oftentimes, you know, they can't even see their own hypocrisy. And this case study is going to show you that because majority of these women on here, you know, got weaves in their head, fake hair, fake hair that's not theirs. And you'll see what the man says when they call him out for his wig. He says, but it's my hair. And he acknowledges that it's a fake hair piece. And women say the same thing when you call out their weave, their fake hair, their wigs. It's my hair because I bought it. The hypocrisy of women. Just another case study. Roll that footage. <laughs> Let's go ahead and bring out our next single guy. Hello, welcome in. What's your Hello. name? Hello, my name is Pointer. Pointer, how old are you? I'm 30. Okay, and what do you do? I am a talk show host and an educator. Okay, very cool. Uh, what are some things I can do for fun? I love to do the three E's. I like to eat. I like to exercise and I like entertainment. I like to be entertained. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> um, so what are some things you look for in a woman? What I'm looking for in a woman, most importantly, uh, you have to love Jesus. Mm. I love Jesus. Um, and I also want a woman that's romantic. You know, um, I believe it was the prolific artist Mario that said, you should let me love you. Let me be the one to give you everything you want and need. Ah. 
Well, y'all know, y'all know that. Okay, okay, yeah. But Mario, you know. Let's go on over there see why they ended up all popping. Right, all right. <laughs> Jojo, why'd you pop your balloon? Uh, at first, it was it was the look, it was the hair, <laughs> but you're it's a character. Your name and age? <laughs> My name is Shayna, and yes. I'm thirty. Awesome. Okay, I love that you love the Lord. Yes. But honestly, you are way too funny for me. <laughs> Thank you. Let's go on over here. Your name and age? I'm Deja Marie. I'm 33. Awesome. And Deja Marie, why did you end up popping your balloon? When you came out, it almost seemed like you were in costume. And I didn't like the hair piece or like the toupee or what that is. So it was just... The hair was it, was... it was just the... It just seemed like you were in maybe costume or something. I, is it a hair piece? Uh, it, it, it identifies as a part of me, but I switch it up. Just like a lot of my beautiful queens, we all go from one hairstyle to the next in like a day or two. So I like okay. to switch it up. <laughs> all right. Your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon. My name is Misha and I'm 27. Um, the reason that I popped my balloon, um, I just kind of felt like it wasn't serious when you came out it kind of felt like a like she said kind of like a like a show or something but i was just really trying to see the real you and i don't feel like i'm getting the real you right now your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon my name is Miriam. i'm 34. um at first it was the overall look um it was just too cheesy for me it's going over here your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon Briante, uh 27 and um I can't take you home to my parents. I cannot. What would the parents say? What? What's, no. I'm a good, classy Poor man. Whole family. The they whole family. A clown. Uh, I'm sorry. I what's cannot. I don't. Do I look they like Ronald? Clown. Do I look like Not Ronald? You were oh, clown. oh, they, they would clown. clown. Why? Why would they clown me? They think I'd probably be joking taking you there. Mm, yikes. I mean, not really. Maybe the, me and her maybe have similar hair kind of situations oh, going no. on. So I kind of not a wig. Oh no, no, I'm just not a wig. no. Well, this isn't really either. But I like your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon. Hi, I'm Tanaya. I'm 27. Um, I just can't get with the overall appearance, and oh, I just wouldn't take you serious. And okay. I need someone that's serious. Name hanging. and age and why you end up popping at the end. My name is Zola Stone. I'm 31, and you know I get it because I'm in entertainment too. But I just, I wanted to see you without the wig and the glasses. Well, these are prescription. I can't, I can't, decision. I wouldn't be able to see how beautiful you are without them. This is the my brand. It's my hair. That is all the balloons popped. We thank do you. thank you for coming on, giving us some thank laughs. You. Thank you. I, I was serious. <laughs> oh, but, well, let's give it up for him, ladies. Thank you, ladies. <laughs>